Hello again there, once again, for part 2 of my uh, review of uh, September 25th, 2020 and we are now on our uh, fourth, fourth uh, stock which is HLCM. Now HLCM started a very big down day on Monday and then suddenly it's just on a sideways pattern. So if you take a look at this, but as we all know, this could be a start of a strong downtrend. Take a look at that over there. Now, the way I would like to do it, let's jump in to the five minute candle to have a very more visualization on what happened this week. So as you can see here, Friday here then Monday here open and it suddenly just went down zoom down and then Tuesday went strong down buyer supported so let's go back buyer supported so if we go back to the dailies what happened buyers who are here bought again here so that's why on tuesday it suddenly went up buyers over here if we drew uh, this area here let's put a line there so i have a better understanding there you go buyers there that's why if we take a look at the five minute there you go buyers took over unfortunately it went all the way to 550 tried again could not do it and now it is still sideways for the past two to three days the good thing about this particular stock is buyers were here again so I hope Monday this will easily go above 550 and stay above 550 in order for it to start its journey to break the downtrend and may continue up but other than that I hope this stock will be able to break its downtrend to change to an uptrend now our last stock is FGen now FGen on the other hand is quite I would say it's a wedge so ever since from here strong downtrend buyers bought this area here it went up strong could not break the sellers here went strong down and now it is on its pretty range rangy but I was thinking that buyers are having higher highs higher highs unfortunately it was not able to break 2565 area it tried again here could not break above so people got tired that's why there's a sell-off now now again in this particular area what happened today now we're more interested in what happened today if you take a look at the five minute right this is what happened on the 25th the market closed here open drop down buyer supported here go back to the daily this is what happened buyers here bought back here trying to support their position then let's go back to the five minute so what happened was buyers were here and look at that strong candle went down just like what we see on MBT 
looking that there will be a continuation to the downside unfortunately it was just buyings over there so that was a good sign today now I hope tomorrow or, or no on Monday this will stay above 2380 and try to stay there in order for it to have a chance to go back to 2560 this area here if it does not then I'm not so sure but let us see so today the good thing about this look at that candle buyers answer there to save the day and it closed just near where it started so let's hope this stock has enough power to go up so that's about it for this week um, see you guys next week and enjoy your weekend for another DC market review hope you hope you like this trade if you uh, hope you like this review and if you have any comments please and please uh, do uh, put your comments down below and subscribe to my channel for more for your support thank you very much and enjoy the rest of your week weekend